Hey YouTube, welcome back to Hetflix number 88. We're getting close to 90 and we're working on 100. Very excited about that. Today we have an awesome vlog. We're gonna show you a super star snake and that's not an adjective, that's its name. It is the Super Inchy Leopard Lab or the Super Starburst. Before we get into it, we're gonna look at the dad and the kind of how we did this and we're gonna look at the crazy clutch that came out of it and then talk about where we're gonna go next. It's really, really an exciting project. Probably one of the most exciting products I have with lavender and we're just mashing them all together. Let's jump into it. So a little history on the Starburst project. Actually, I had no idea how great it would end up being. We knew that the Inchi albino was very beautiful. It had some pinks in it. And so I thought, man, it'd be really great to get the Inchi into the lavender and see if it also had an amazing effect. We didn't know that Leopard was gonna be this really, really cool, you know, it factor for that snake and just absolutely boost that pink. And when it first hatched, it was not that pink. It was very impressive. I thought, what's going on here? It's, 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 it's pretty interesting. But then the Starburst, they just get better and better. Not even with sheds, they get better literally every day after they have their first shed, they're a little bit better every single time you look at them. And that's a really, really cool effect. So we're gonna start out by looking at that dad and see how much he's improved from this tiny baby picture all the way to now. And then we're gonna look at what we're expecting to be even better from these babies. All right, so we're gonna show you the dad before we look at the babies. The dad's insanely great. He's actually in here with an orange dream, yellow belly dream sickle. Oh, and he was locked up with her earlier. And of course, she's insane. That's an inception dream sickle, basically. So orange dream, dream sickle, orange dream, yellow bad dream sickle. And then he is the Enchi Leopard Lavender. So that's the original male Starburst. We have one female, it's a little older, but check out how all the white on him has become a solid bubblegum pink. It's beyond words and one of the best ball python combos become in better and better with age. That's so rare with ball pythons. Normally, we feel like we're winning if they look as good with age, but here's an animal that looks even better as it grows. So you can imagine how excited, as we saw this animal grow up, we saw it become an adult. I thought, what happens if we double up the Yenshi, if we double up the effect of the pink in the snake, what are we gonna end up with? So let's go look up that clutch now. All right, look at these babies. There's actually one really weird anomaly in the clutch. I'm gonna explain to you. It's kind of odd, but we do see it every so often. The pairing was the Starburst, so Inchi Leopard Lav, to a Inchi Het Lav. And what came out, one baby, we had a gene that wasn't even in the pairing. This is a blackhead Inchi Het Lav. And this actually came from last year's pairing. I actually bred a leopard blackhead Lav to the Inchi Het Lav last year, and she didn't go because of the move. She was one of those early clutches for me that the girl reabsorbed in their move and we got one baby out of the clutch that had blackhead in it. Kind of interesting to see that, but it's amazing how long the females can retain the sperm, because really, literally, it's been basically a, a full 12 months or so, if not 14 months since she was last bred to this male, and uh, there they are, there's the, the baby. But the rest of them all came from the correct male, and we ended up with beautiful Inchi Leopard, insanely amazing super inchy leopard absolutely incredible that's a powerhouse another super inchy leopard and then was getting to the visuals these are wild inchy lav and you can already see the pink starting to come in as amazing as these inchy labs are as babies it's almost almost don't want to show them because they're so good and yet they're going to become so much better that you don't want to judge them based on how they look now then we ended up with the Super Inchy Lavender, and this might be the first one ever made. I don't know, I, I have an inkling that somebody has made this before me, but very impressive, really impressive. You can tell the Super Inchy because it has really, really, really wide eye stripes that connect in the back. Um, it's it's this, the Super Inchy look, and you see every single marking is just absolutely completely surrounded in a bubblegum pink um, border. What's gonna happen is those, all that white marking is gonna completely fill in. So here we have the superstar, the super starburst. So a super inchy leopard lab, and it turned out absolutely incredible. You know, one of the hallmarks of the, the starburst project is that it actually gets better with age. You know, it starts out fairly white, 
This snake turned out phenomenal from the very first shed. All right, so here he is. Check out how insanely orange it is right off the bat. Instead of just being edged in the pink, it is absolutely filled in already. Basically, it looks like a starburst. It's already about four to five months old, and so it's about 50%. I'm so looking forward to seeing this animal um, grow up, and I think it's become much, much more saturated in pink than the starburst ever was, just because it has that double dose of the Enchi gene. So before you go, I want to give you just a little bit of a preview into some of the videos we hope to be coming this summer, where we're really, really trying to develop this project in different ways. First of all, we're trying to do a super inchy yellow belly leopard starburst. So that's going to get another layer with the yellow belly in there. We know that that's phenomenal in that project. But actually, the one I'm most excited about is to the original female starburst. She's already almost up to size, and we did our very best lavender male. Let's go check that out. All right, so you guys might remember from 2019, we made the most insane lavender ever. And this is what we called the honeycomb snake because it has just absolute labyrinth of a pattern on it. Very, very unusual. And some of it looks like a little geometric. It has turned a very, very interesting shade. This is leopard, blackhead, confusion, yellow belly, lavender, I believe. Uh, we're still trying to prove him out, but he's actually been breeding to the original starburst girl and so she is getting close to ovulating now big follicles and maybe maybe towards the fall we can actually get a combination of maybe blackhead and the confusion and yellow belly into the original enchi leopard lab there's just so much cool cool potential in this project and I think these two combined are gonna make some of the craziest stuff we've ever seen from this project. All right, guys, that's it. That's a superstar project and a little bit of a window into what we're looking for this year from that project. So give me in the comments below, which one are you most excited about? The superstar, which we just made, the inception star, which is orange dream with it, or how about maybe the confusion star? The confusing star, we need to think of a good name for that. But really excited about it, guys. And also, you should be seeing some Patreon members here. Very, very proud of how the Patreon started. You guys blew me away. We had low expectations because honestly, we're just, you know, a ball python breeder in a, in a room. And you guys, I really appreciate the fact that you're supporting and you're jumping in there and we're trying to fill it full of amazing content so that it's absolutely worth it and it's an amazing community for you guys. So thanks again to all you guys for, for joining up. And you can see the link in the description below. Thank you and we'll see you next week.